This is JBigTicket23 from GreenPCGamers.com. In this video, we're going to show you how to install an LSI9341 8i controller into a Dell Precision T7910 workstation. So this is an add-on RAID controller. Um, and it's, you know, it's a pretty slick RAID controller. I mean, it, it's very similar to the integrated SAS controller in that it supports uh, 12 gig per second SAS drives and 6 gig per second SATA drives. Um, it does have two internal SAS connections. Uh, the big difference, other than it's an add-on card, is that it supports RAID 5. So the integrated RAID controller only supports 0, 1, or 10. With this RAID controller, you can support RAID 5. Uh, the, the other cool thing about this card, and we're just going to take a look at the actual card itself right now. It's pretty small, compact, uh, PCI Express slot. Um, here are the SAS connections. And that's what I was getting to. The cool part about this card is you don't need an additional cable to plug this card in. All you do is plug the SAS cable that's set up for the integrated RAID controller and you move it over to SAS port 0 on this card. So unlike systems in the past where if you added a RAID controller you had to actually add a RAID or a, a, an additional SAS cable this this system you don't have to do it which is really really slick and we're going to show you that here so there's two uh, PCI Express slots that we could use we could use this slot down here not a big fan of doing that because we have a big bad GTX 1080 card installed and we don't want uh, that card smothering those fans we also don't want that SAS cable um, getting lodged into the fans. So we're going to go with the slot above the graphics card. Um, and so we'll go ahead and pop that right in. All you do is line it up and drop the card in. And then put your retention clip back on. So you can watch the video to show you more about it. You might be thinking, why not use the PCI Express slot on the top of the chassis? Well, we only have one processor installed. So those slots are not available to us. And we also don't have enough SAS cable to reach those top slots. Okay, so our card's installed. Luckily, SAS port 0 is on the top. So what we'll do, and this is going to be kind of hard to see because the lighting's bad, but you can see the cable right there that's plugged into the integrated SAS controller. We're going to go ahead and pull that cable out. And as you can see, it's the same interface. And we can get a little bit more room with that by moving it from that retention bracket and basically line the card up like so or line the cable up like so and go ahead and click it right into place and that's really all there is to installing the card obviously put your side panel back on if you need help configuring the ray we did a different video on that so um, you can go check out our channel find that video it'll show you exactly how to configure the raid it's pretty simple. Um, if you um, need uh, more information or you want to see other additional content on Precision T7910s or other Dell workstations, visit GreenPCGamers.com. Uh, we have a ton of free content on how to upgrade systems. Uh, definitely subscribe to the YouTube channel if you like what you're seeing. Um, also, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for free giveaways. Uh, we get a lot of access equipment for the how-to videos that we do, whether it be graphics cards, um, NVMe drives, uh, you know, tons of different components. Um, follow us, and, and then you'll qualify for those giveaways. Um, if you have live, uh, if you have, if you if you want to ask live hardware questions, go ahead and follow me on Twitch. Uh, you can see my handle jbigticket23. I'm happy to answer live hardware questions right on Twitch. Um, and that's all I got for you. Thanks a lot for watching.